Hello everyone. So today's question is why KNN is called the lazy algorithm. So KNN is K nearest algorithm. Okay, K nearest neighbor algorithm. So why it is called lazy algorithm? So let's understand first how KNN works. So for example, we have two classes, red class and a, a blue class, right? So whenever a new data, a data point comes, for example, this green is a new data point. So whenever a new data point comes, it finds the nearest neighbors, right? So see here, for example, we have k equals to three. So we will uh, consider three nearest neighbor. So see here, it has considered three nearest neighbor. So two are blue and one is red. So we'll consider that the new data points belong to the blue class, okay? So the new data points belongs to the blue class. So like this KNN works. Okay, so now why it is called the lazy algorithm? Just because when the training phase comes, it do not do any task in training phase. Let me write it does not do anything in training phase. That is, that is it does no training at all when, when we supply the training data. When we supply the training data, right? So, at training time, all is all it does is what it will do in training time. It will only store the data set in the training time. It only stores data in training time. Okay. And when a new data point comes, that is when a new test data point comes, it starts finding the distance from other data points and do all the computations at that time. Okay, so all the computations happens during the testing time, that is scoring time, that is when we apply a unseen data to the point. So all the computations happens during Scoring. That is, that is when we apply the model and unseen data point. Okay, so this is the reason why KNN is called the lazy algorithm because it doesn't do anything at the training point. As soon as the new data points come, it starts finding the distances and do all the computation part. So this is the reason behind the lazy algorithm. 